I first began seriously to invent languages about um, when I was 13 or 14. I've never stopped, really. Languages have a flavour to me, which I, I never understand people saying, saying, for instance, it was awfully dry and dull, because a new language to me is, is just like taking a new wine or a new sweet beet or something. What I'm doing now is to try and write in Elvish, which I'm saying my writing is very inferior to the Elv. That's standard greeting when meeting. A star shines upon our meeting. Mistake, never mind. And that stands for Ellen Sila Lumen Omenti Elvo. It's a piece of rather beautiful language, I think. Well, mm -hmm. some, people, some people seem to sort of take a delight in being able to sort of think in Elvish, which seems a little odd. No, no, no. I, want other people, I wouldn't mind other people knowing it and enjoying it, but I didn't really want to uh, make, well, like some uh, people who have, who have been equally inventive in language have done, who sort of make cults and have people all speaking it together. No, I don't desire to go and have uh, afternoons talking Elvish to chaps. One thing, of course, uh, Elvish is too complicated. I've never finished making it.